Hey everybody, it's Ben reminding you that I can only do my videos with your support. So please sponsor me for five bucks a month at patreon.com slash Premium. You're gonna love it. You get rewards and exclusive raunchier, edgier bonus content that only my Patreon supporters get to see. Thank you, I love you. Welcome to Spooky Sammy's Late Night Fright Fest. I'm your host, Spooky Sammy. <laughs> oh, I don't know if you've heard. I don't want to brag, but I uh, was just nominated for Best Local TV Host. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. By the prestigious Midwestern Broadcast Journalist Association Awards, which will be presented at the Ramada Inn off of I-70 at 45th Street in Lenexa next month. Yes. Yes, and the celebrity guest host for the awards is going to be none other than Bart Bashford. Yes, the Topeka news anchor. Oh my God, I can't wait to meet him. I can't. He's a local legend and just like I am. <laughs> Now, you know the award means nothing to me. It means nothing to Spooky Sammy. No, I do this I do this show for the love. It's a labor of love, yes. I do it for the joy of it. Yes, the joy of scaring the living shit out of little children and old people and people who are sitting on their couches on the weekends getting stoned and drinking themselves into oblivion because there's nothing to do in this lame city. Yes, yes, Kansas City. We're here and we're all living in quiet desperation, self-medicating with vodka, Xanax, pot beans, Adderall, and vibrating sex toys that we slowly shove up our asses while furiously masturbating to mock choking porn. <laughs> I really don't care if I win the award for best local TV host. However, I do think Everyone should know that my biggest competition in this category is Denise DeMarco, who hosts Good Morning Kansas City. Oh, bless her heart. Oh, gosh, she tries, she does, with her big fake breasts and her big hair and her hideous clown-like makeup. She does her best to try to brighten our mornings here in the greater metropolitan Kansas City area. Her address, I think, is 5554 East 98th Street. I don't know why I said that. I, I just it just flew out of me. But you know, you know, it, 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 wouldn't it be a shame if something happened to Denise in the next few weeks? I mean, I'm not saying I want something horrible to happen to Denise, but it wouldn't it be awful if something did happen to Denise, some sort of tragic accident? That would be awful, wouldn't it? I'm sure she'll be fine. Yes, yes, Denise won't be suddenly run over by a car or hit over the head from behind with a blunt object in a dark parking lot after work. No, nothing like that will ever happen to you, Denise, I'm sure. Denise, I wish you all the best. Yes, best of luck, Denise. I love you, yes. May the best host live, I mean win. Now it's time for tonight's Fright Fest feature, Terror Train. Yes, Terror Train. This is actually a rare and little seen Canadian slasher film starring Scream Queen Jamie Lee Curtis and Oscar winner Ben Johnson that is set aboard a moving train on New Year's Eve. Yes, yes, it follows a bunch of horny medical students. I like that. Yes, and they're all pursued by a killer who actually steals their New Year's Eve costumes in order to avoid being caught. <laughs> That actually sounds like me last Halloween in downtown Kansas City. <laughs> you know, this feature actually has a huge twist at the end. Yes, yes, I won't give it away, but it has something to do with magicians and things not always appearing as they seem. Oh, what the hell, spoiler alert. The magician's assistant isn't a chick. It's a dude with a dick, and he's out for revenge. <laughs> 
This movie also stars Hunky McHunkerson, Hart Bachner, from Breaking Away, who's even hotter and sexier in this movie than any of his other films. Yes, I'll probably freeze frame all of Hart's scenes in my dressing room this evening. Yes, yes, I'll freeze frame them and I'll shove one of those vibrating sex toys that I spoke of earlier way up my ass while doing laughing gas in between takes of me in here in the studio. <laughs> Talk about terrifying. Oh my God, wouldn't it be awful if our cameraman here at the studio, Marvin, decided to sneak into my dressing room during the taping and accidentally caught me playing with my vibrating sex toy? <laughs> Here it is, the 1980, rarely seen Canadian slasher classic, Terror Train. <laughs> Marvin, I have drugs. Come into my dressing room with the camera. Yes, I have drugs, Marvin. I have drugs. Hey everybody, I'm Ben Zook. Hey, do me a favor, please hit that thumbs up like button and please click on my face to subscribe so that you get all of my videos whenever I post them on YouTube. Hey, and please consider sponsoring me on the Patreon platform. Just go to patreon.com slash Premium right now and for just five bucks a month, the price of a cup of coffee, you get exclusive bonus episodes of all my shows every week. Yeah, that aren't available on YouTube. You also get exclusive bonus content that only my Patreon supporters get to see, like comedy shorts and bloopers and outtakes and behind the scenes footage and, and more. You know, I produce this channel all by myself and that takes money. Uh, it takes money for production costs, for wardrobe. My wig budget alone is astronomical. And Patreon is a great way for you to support the content that you love on a monthly basis and get terrific perks and rewards in the process. Hey guys, thank you so much for your support. I love you and I really can't thank you enough. Ben Zook has his very own TV channel.